Hi guys, Sumnes, and these are my top tips for you if you play Ascent and if you play Cypher. For A side, I use like those steps for jet to counter jets, and I put another uh, cage here if they break this trap, and I'm also putting another trap here. But these are like it depends on the usual situation, but most likely the camera I'm using this one to see short and main together so whenever they are coming to the side i open this cage and i try to kill the jet and if they come from short then i also open this and i try to kill the other guy with the trap and you can also like put another trap here but they people are usually not expecting and you guys know like the walls are like a paper so you can literally kill the person who trapped here like this also if you play retake a you can like do the this trap and maybe like another one here but open this cage and try to shoot with the traps for b the one like trap that i like and use mostly it's this Like when they're trying to come and jump this, they get trapped and you can also like kill them from markets. Also the camera that I'm using for B is this. You can also not open your camera when they come to B. Like you can um, open the camera and see the positions of people and you can like ping for your teammates. There is also one cage here. You can also like put the cage here and hide inside of this. For attack side, I usually use this camera when I control like mid and A. I usually like to do this when it's like a high level SOA, like really good SOA players. When I put my camera here, they usually shock darts, right? And I'm just like giving noise that I put my camera here and I'm taking back so they're just using their shock dart here for nothing and I'm just taking my camera back for 10 seconds not 40 or 30 I don't remember now <laughs> usually if you're a killjoy you should play I'm playing like this basically I'm putting my alarm bot like more towards right or left so they can't break it so so I can't break with the shock dart you can User turret for here. This molly for Sova. When they they usually come here and drone. And if you wanna like cancel the drone, you're mullying like this. You guys also can use the other molly uh, for C long to block or C side for jet. If you feel like they will push garage and you can just alarm bot this and two molly here. And if you have Astra, you can tell your Astra to pull with your alarm bot contact and you can just pull them when they're pushing. I can show you guys like some setups that you guys can do with the bridge if you have it. You can just put your threads here or here, doesn't matter and your molly is like this. And when they're coming B, you can tell your bridge to stun with the turret contact and you can just molly them in for A. You can turret like this and it's again with the bridge setup like the maybe alarm bot here molly this with the turret contact you your bridge was done you're gonna molly maybe and you kill and I go back like this usually if they if the enemy team has bridge he's gonna play here so when the round starts I'm putting my molly like this or this doesn't matter and I'm trying to molly this maybe they won't break it and when we like uh, start post plant you can molly this to like cancel his like stuff or reposition him you know there is a like a barrier here and you're waiting and you're holding your cross like this for turret and you're putting your turret like this and I usually depends on my team where they are playing if they're playing A I'm putting my alarm bot here and if they're playing C, I'm putting my alarm bot on A. That's also pretty much it. One of the important like uh, thing that you need to do if they're eco and if they're like if you know they're gonna push you because they usually do this, you can just uh, put your turret like this and you don't have to go here and get stunned and die, you know. 
I, I died a lot like this, so... <laughs> Thank you for uh, watching guys, and I hope these informations are useful for you.